Heather, can I borrow your pencil for a second? Sure. Awesome. And you might build like a bar also. I do. Oh, nice. Oh, I'm going shopping. You better get it back. Okay, <laughs> here we go. This is very, very cool. You're gonna count to three, and on three, the magic's gonna happen, okay? All right. Count with me, okay? One, One two, two, three. three. Isn't that great? <laughs> Actually, it's right over here. Isn't that great though? But seriously, um, the real magic happens when you go one, two, two three. three. Just like that. Isn't that <laughs> you know where the bill went though, right? No. It went straight to my bank account. <laughs> Better not. <laughs> Thanks. Here's the explanation for the pencil and bill vanish. You can actually use a pen or you could use a piece of paper. Anything that actually fits in your hand will work for this. I like to use bills because they're all over the place. Um, take the bill, you borrow the bill, and you fold it into a little packet. You're gonna put that into your left hand. With your right hand, you're gonna tap the pencil and have the audience count with you. It's best to have the audience on your left for this, as you'll see in a moment. Basically, you're gonna count with you as you go one, two, three. By the way, you're gonna tell them that something magical is gonna happen on three. Don't tell them what. Just one, two, three. On three, you're gonna put the pencil right behind your ear. It's a very old principle of magical misdirection. As they look at the pencil in your ear, you say you're gonna to point to the pencil and you're gonna say that I got you. And as you take the pencil off, you're gonna put the bill that's in your left hand in your back pocket in that moment. So now your hand comes back out, the bill's no longer there, and you see the real magic's gonna happen now on the count of three. One, two, three, and the bill vanishes. And that's the explanation for the pencil and bill vanish.